Hey guys, how's it going? It's Bill Moore. Got another one of those savory sauces from Zoltan's Sauces, and they're based down there in uh, Plantation, Florida. That's near the uh, Fort Lauderdale area. And the one I'm going to be reviewing today is their hot version. Uh, once again, this is from Zoltan's All Natural Hot Savory Sauce, and this is the hot one. Let's check out that label, really cool looking label of that, uh, looks like a genie with some fire there in that hand. But uh, once again, this is the uh, hot savory sauce. Let me go ahead and read a little bit about it here from the website. It says a magic, sweet, and bold blend of honey, garlic, black pepper, and cinnamon. And with the addition of habanero peppers providing the extra kick of flavor that you are looking for. Our premium sauces will add a sweet, bold, and zesty flavor to your meats, fishes, poultry, and any other dishes that need that extra zing. Now I did find that their, uh, their original version, not the hot one, the one I re uh, reviewed before, was uh, very flavorful, but I think it's a type of sauce that is really gonna be good on grilled meats, and that's exactly what I did with this one. Let me go ahead and read the hotter version. Now you do have to be a lover of honey, uh, honey is up front and in your face in these sauces, uh, but it's uh, it's a pretty good blend of uh, these ingredients. Uh, the sodium is pretty high, but uh, that's kind of to be expected with sauces uh, like this type. Uh, we got 300 milligrams, but the uh, ingredients, we start off with Louisiana-style hot sauce, which is aged cayenne peppers, distilled vinegar, salt, and xanthan gum. So it's another one of those hot sauces that's made with hot sauce. I've uh, reviewed hot sauces that were made with salsa, uh, so that's that's interesting. And then we have honey, sugar, apple cider vinegar, garlic, natural flavor, and then in parentheses contains milk, uh, salt, black pepper, and cinnamon. Now, once again, I've already opened this up because I marinated something and then grilled it up, and I'll show you that here in a minute. But the aroma on this one is like a spicy, sweet, uh, hot honey. That's what I'm really getting, just a blast of honey up front. This one doesn't have quite a bit as the uh, much of a vinegar tang as the milder one did. But you get that sweetness, I believe that's coming from the cinnamon, a little bit of garlic, but just a real spicy, sweet honey aroma. So you gotta love honey. If you don't like the um, aroma on honey, uh, you will not like this. Uh, you can see the black pepper in here as well, but uh, this looks like kind of a syrupy, sticky, syrupy type sauce. Mm. But once again, it's very sweet. It tastes good. It's just that I think that this is a type of sauce that uh, it's so sweet that you're not going to be using it every day as a table sauce, but you're going to use it on special occasions. I think this would be really good on to make some type of stir fry uh, chicken or you know like the general's chicken or the uh, orange chicken you know the breaded chi uh, chicken chunks that are that are uh, tossed around in that uh, spicy um, thick uh, general's uh, sauce this would be perfect for that but I also believe it would be really good um, on pork and so what I did is I grilled up some um, these are boneless country style pork spare ribs so take a look at that doesn't that look good so I just grilled those up, and this is a real sticky uh, type sauce, so it, uh, it works really well for this to give it that nice kind of sticky glaze, and that's exactly uh, what you're looking for in this. But uh, here we go. We're going to try it on this pork. Mmm. I did let this marinate overnight as well. Um, very good. I think this is where this sauce shines, is on grilled meats. This is not something you're going to use as a table sauce to just pour on your eggs or breakfast sandwiches or anything like that. I think because of the honey, because of the sweetness, uh, because of how kind of sticky it is, this is a type of sauce. It's not a table hot sauce, but a cooking sauce, marinade, finishing glaze type sauce that works well with chicken, pork, shrimp, anything like that. So, um, but uh, good flavor on this one. I think it's just something that, you know, it just has a special uses. But on flavor, I like this. I'm going to give this a 7 out of 10 for flavor. 
Now on heat on this one, this is kicked up just a little bit, but it's still not quite uh, a medium habanero burn, but it's uh, lower than medium for me. So I'm going to give it a three out of 10 for heat on the Zoltan's all natural hot savory sauce. This is the hot one. Really nice looking labels on there and the nice um, eight ounce size bottles. Now everybody you can find them at uh, on the Facebook at Zoltan Sauces and their website is Zoltan Sauces dot com so check them out thanks very much uh, guys for sending the sauces i appreciate it and everybody check them out thanks for watching and until the next time don't forget enjoy the burn we'll see you guys later